While the ground war continues in Ukraine, there's another war to watch out for. Yeah, a cyber one. Cities across the country are warning people about a possible Russian cyber attack mm. here in the U.S. CBS 17 consumer investigator Steve Sprasha joining us now with this. And Steve, what do we need to do to make sure that we safeguard ourselves? A number of steps we can take. The bottom line, Rod, a Russian cyber attack can be crippling to both individuals and companies and virtually shut down our way of life. And I've learned how Russian attackers can use our own computers to stage such an attack or conversely hold everything in our computers for personal ransom. The average person on a scale of 1 to 10, how worried should we be about this right now? Uh, at 11. We all remember the colonial pipeline shut down when Russian hackers crippled our gas supply for days. But security expert Craig Petronella says this time around, it could be far worse. So I do think that they're going to do blanket attacks, which means that they're going to scan for low hanging fruit. <laughs> One low-hanging fruit, your cell phone, where hackers will use robocalls to infect thousands of phones. Those are definitely effective methods of mass distribution of malware and different bad files and data destruction. Because our phones are synced to our computers, that malware can migrate from them and go after big corporations by creating a denial-of-service attack which crashes their systems. They basically have all these slave computers all ready to go, and then they just push a button, and then they all attack, you know, at one time. And your own computers can also be held for ransomware. We have a lot of pictures and different data, right? And they want that data, and that data is typically important to us, so they're going to try to ask for some type of extortion to lock up your stuff. Petronella says, back up your photos and other critical data with several different vendors, or better yet, on a device not even connected to the Internet. In addition to backups to protect yourself, you should use automatic fraud call blocking on your phones, use PIN codes on your accounts, don't click on links and text messages, and use complex, hard-to-guess passwords. But don't reuse those passwords to keep track of all those different complex passwords you're using. Use a password manager app and change those passwords frequently. We can't emphasize that enough. These days, we all have to become our own cybersecurity cops to protect ourselves. Working for you, I'm consumer investigator Steve Sprasia. It is hard to keep up with all those passwords, though. It really I'm not going to lie. Yeah. It's tough, but, but a necessary thing to do, Steve, so thank you. Travelers at RDU will soon have another airline that they can choose from. Avello Airlines announced that it's going to offer one-way fares between RDU 